Right. Is there a difference between asking Allah for forgiveness and repentance? Yes. Forgiveness is when you ask Allah, Oh Allah, I messed up and it's written against me. So please pardon me and wipe it away. All right? So it's wiped off your book of good deeds. But a person can still be um, distant from God. So, I mean, the, the way the ulama describe it is like a slave. You have a slave and you tell him do this, this and this. And then um, he just doesn't do it. Or he does the opposite. And you can get annoyed with him, but he might apologize and you can say, okay, I forgive you. That's one slave. And you have another type of slave who does, who gets told what to do. He doesn't do it and then he runs off as well. So if he runs away and after an hour or two he thinks, you know what, no, he's been too, too kind to me, I need to go back. And he goes back and he says, I'm really sorry for what I did. Here, I will do whatever you ask. I'll do my best. He might mess up again the next day, but he's saying, I'm, I'm here ready to do whatever you want. I'll do my best. That's what that's what the slave is, right? So tawbah is realigning yourself with Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, stopping the sin, making uh, your mind up never to go back. Uh, you desire, you know, and you re you re regret it, you know, and uh, so a person could c um, commit a sin but not necessarily regret it, yeah, and then so he does something. Astaghfirullah, oh Allah, forgive me. Um, but then he goes and does it again, planning to do it. You get it. So tawbah includes more, right? And uh, repentance is is a, a degree deeper, but though it does include uh, istighfar in a sense. Yeah. La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah.